Hello and welcome to Gloucestershire Music's Get Playing series. My name's Liam and today we're going to be talking about how to put a mini bassoon together. So these are just bassoons that have been designed for younger children to be able to start learning younger rather than going straight onto a full size which would be a bit big and heavy. So what we're going to do is we're going to look at this joint here which is called the butt joint. As you see it's got these two little holes at the top of it here. One is slightly bigger than the other now into the smaller of the two holes, we're going to put this joint, which is called the wing joint. It's called this because it has this little shape here that looks like a pair of wings. So we put this into the smaller hole, and then into the bigger hole, we put this joint here, which is called the long joint because it's the longest of the four main joints that you have on a bassoon. We then put that into the, uh, the bigger hole there, and then at the top of the long joint, you see it's got this rod that goes up here. And then we put on the final joint, which is called the bell. And to get it in the right place, we just have to make sure that these two rods here are lined up with each other. Now, there's a little hole here at the end of the wing joint. And this is where we put this joint, which is called the crook. And this is the bit that we blow into to make the sound via this bit here, which is called the reed, uh, which is just two little bits of cane that are strapped together. We put that on the end of the crook like this, and we have our bassoon, but in order to be able to have our hands in the right place, we have this extra little joint down here, which is called the bird, because it looks a little bit like a bird. And we screw this in to here, and with smaller hands than mine, this is where it will go in properly. Now, a note for teachers is that this is a transposing instrument, so when you play a C on the mini bassoon, it will sound as a G on the piano. So if you're trying to tune your student to a piano, then that's where it's going to come from. Uh. 